Hey everybody, hope your day's going well. We are back with Aurora. Do you feel? We're uh, almost uh, approaching the end of this album. And it's been, a, like I said, a diverse album, many different sounds. It's a great one, a great project. And uh, man, I'm excited for this song. And then I believe uh, the next one is going to be Starvation. And I, I've been holding that off for so long because I saw that video pass so many times. <laughs> oh man. All right, let's go. Do you feel? Never give up this feeling. Ooh. Never okay. give up on You can give up on me. Never give up on love. And I heard bodies and then our bones. We both sing in deeper tones. And mm. the fire we both run to hide. It reminds me of a song, but I can't put my, I don't know, to, like, it, it, it reminds me of, maybe it's just a, a type of sound, like, 80s dance type of vibe, maybe I'm getting, I don't know, but I do like it, the, never give up on love, you know, you can give up on me, but never give up uh, our love, you know, so, also, like, if a relationship is failing, like, Please don't give up on love because sometimes that happens for a while. Sometimes you get over it and sometimes it takes a bit, a bit longer. I also like the line in our bodies and in our bones. We both sing deeper, sing in deeper tones, like, like a strong connection into the fire. We both run to hide. And that could mean different things. Maybe like fire sometimes represents conflict, you know, and people sometimes in a toxic relationship, they sometimes they like that push and pull without realizing it consciously into the fire we both run to hide but also fire means passion right so sometimes we ignore our problems go straight to passion and you know everything's good and then you know the problems start again and then you, you hide in that fire again we both run to hide and we ignore the other things you know and not communicate so it's probably that but you know it could mean a, a number of things uh, amazing stuff man come on amazing stuff uh, again, you know, more a uh, different sound again, you know, and, and that's again, something I really enjoy about this album, which I've seen people name, uh, favorites in comments and, and it's pretty different. There's certain in the lines, conflict in mind, maybe, um, God, yeah, now I'm blanking on the title, uh, a soul with no king. I saw a lot starvation. I saw a lot that that have favorites but there's many other favorites that i've seen which is great like uh that means there's something in there for everybody if the discussion is oh this is my favorite no no that far end that last song is my favorite no the the middle one this one the eighth track this one i love that a lot and i think as an artist that's great too to experience because even as uh, in my own books if people say oh, i like the first book in your trilogy oh no i like the second no i like the last one that's cool because if everybody said, oh, I only like the first one, the rest you fell off. Like, ooh. <laughs>
Tum, tum. That reminds me of something. Tum, 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 tum. I don't know, man. I can't tell. I'm going to jump straight into starvation after this, too. I might not publish it right away, but I will record it right now. <laughs> I can't wait any longer. But I really enjoyed this song for, you know, it's almost like a, you know, you can definitely hear this at a party. It's not, you know, some of these were heavier. There's a little bit of that in there, but there's also more hope in it. Like, never give up on love. I need it. You got me burned. I can't stop. It feels like I need it to combine with that upbeat tempo. And, to, you know, you could definitely have this in your car and just, like, zone out. Uh, well, not zone out in your car. <laughs> Don't zone out in your car, please. Uh, mind the road. But, uh, yeah, that's... It's almost like... I don't know what starvation is about, but that, you know, could be a heavy title. It's almost like, I'm going to give you a breather in between. Give you a little lift up before I tear you down again. Is that it? We'll see. We'll see. But I definitely also can see this song could be like a grower. You know, you have those songs. I like it already. But then it gets in your head and like, that's the songs that, that last a, a while sometimes with me that, you know, like, okay, okay, now I'm listening to it again. And I listen to it again. And now it's on a repeat. Uh, yeah, man. Again, it shows that she is so versatile so diverse within their own music. That's great. I love it. Uh, definitely going to put that on the car playlist. You know, there's other songs on the album that are so good lyrically and heavy and thought provoking, but it's maybe harder to listen to on a daily basis. But this, I can listen to this every day, multiple times a day. Mission accomplished for those streaming roles. Hey, guys, have a great day. See you on the next one. Peace.